My name's Fletcher. That's all you need to know right now. I received a phone call just a minute ago. Potential foul play at a local car park down the road from me. The caller left no ID, so there was no way of tracing it. It's always the last time for me. One last job, something that piques my interest. I should have retired some time ago. In fact, I am retired. But for some reason, the boss just keeps calling me back. And there he was, laying lifeless on the floor. Out of all the death I've seen, this one kind of felt different. It was almost like staring at myself in the eyes, empty, vacant. The only difference is between us, I'm still breathing and he isn't. Lucky for him. Judging from the blood, which was still wet and fresh, I couldn't be that far behind. What's the motive? Why? Are we really free? Some kind of cryptic message? My thoughts were plaguing me, but I knew just the man who I could speak to. An old colleague and friend, Jimmy Braithwaite. The best I knew before I retired. Jimmy. Ah, oh, Fletch is so good to hear from you. It's been what seems like a lifetime since we last spoke. You too. You might want to grab your coat and come on down. I'll take you to the location. <laughs> I should have known better. I thought you were calling me on social terms. Righto, I'll best get ready then. I needed some time away from the darkness. Somewhere to gather my thoughts. The drink has always been a good friend of mine. The only friend. I'm still doing this because of you. The only reason why I'm still here. I hope somehow you can still forgive me. I miss you. You're gonna have to let it go at some point, you know that. And I'll ask for your advice when I need it. With all due respect, there are some things we need to hear without permission in order to break the loop. Poor chap, he found at the car park. Single bullet wound to the head. Not much to work from, I'm afraid. No ID, no next of kin to contact. Who alerted you to the scene? Anonymous call. Hmm. I think, very strange. 
considering you're no longer active. I'll keep you up to date with any updates that may come through. You take care now, won't you? Home sweet home. Well, it used to be. She was the piano player, and I was the audience. What I'd do to hear her playing again. Just one more song. Staring at the escape route that was laying in my left hand. Bullets loaded, ready to go. I thought about it. I thought about it many times. Finally in that constant chit-chatter that runs around my mind 24-7. I just never had the guts to pull the trigger. Where were you on the 25th of June? Why would you ask me that when I'm the one who tipped you off? What kind of criminal mastermind would incriminate himself? These are just questions I have to keep my options open. <laughs> Tell me, Fletcher, are we really free? Controlled since birth, told what to think, how to think. Opinions by others come across as hard facts, rules to live by. Do you live by your own terms? Or is it by the opinion of others that are hardwired into you like some kind of cold machine? You and I both know why you retire. Tired of enforcing a system you no longer believe in? A lost love is a seed that grows into turmoil. You and I are a lot more alike than you think. We just happen to share the same fertilised soil.
speaking. Fletcher. Who's calling? Get down to the wire dock as soon as possible. Who is this? Brave, Jimmy. Fletcher, what's the matter? I think I've just seen a suspect. He's just made off. It's way too fast for me. He's gone out into the fields. Did you get a good look of him? He was dressed exactly the same as the victim. Hmm. I need you to come down here as soon as possible. Take care of the body. I'm going to head back to mine. Right, no problem. I'll tell you notes. Right, I'll be on my way. I'll grab my coat. Can I leave you with that? I'll get it taken care of. You be careful now, won't you? I'm here. What? 
just got off the phone from Jimmy and he just gave us the rundown. And told you and I both know that Jimmy doesn't exist. I don't understand. Fletch. Those two bodies that we found? The bullets match the gun that is issued to the police. We know you killed those two people. I know things ain't been easy since you lost Rose. Don't mention her name. We failed you. We failed you. When you retired, we didn't give you the proper care that you needed. A fletch to do this? This is murder. Fletch, how long have we known each other? Long enough. Long enough. So why didn't you come to see me? Why didn't you come and speak to me? Fletch. You know what this means, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. And you know I can't let you get away with this, right? 